Hello everyone. The topic for this week's lab is combined loading. More specifically, we will be focusing on three different objectives. One, to measure strains on a hollow tubular specimen loaded in bending and to use these in conjunction with beam flexure theory to determine values for three elastic constants, Young's modulus E, Poisson's ratio nu, and the shear modulus G. The material used is the aluminum alloy 6061-T6. 2. To measure strains on the specimen when it is loaded in combined bending and torsion, to use measured strains for the two load cases, along with the theory for bending and for torsion, in order to verify the principle of superposition. And 3. To use Mohr's circle to transform stresses in two dimensions. For this lab, we will move right onto the test procedure, which will consist of seven steps. The test procedure is as follows. First, we will record the wall thickness and diameter of the tube. The apparatus seen now is an L-shaped cantilever beam fixed at a point D. Strain gauges are attached at point C, and loads will be applied at points A and B. Begin by recording the dimensions of the tube at point C. For the next step, identify and record the load that will be applied to the specimen. Now, connect the strain gauges to the strain indicator. There are eight strain gauges at location C arranged as shown in figure 9.2 in your manual. Before applying any loads, balance the gauges and record the values at each strain gauge. These are the initial zero readings. Next, locate point A on the cantilever and apply the load at this point. After the load has stabilized, record the strain gauge readings and unload from point A. Repeat this loading process at point B to record the strain gauge readings there. Lastly, remove the load from point B, allowing the strain gauges to return to zero. Now unloaded, record the final zero conditions of the cantilever. With that, the test procedure for Lab 9 is complete, and you will now proceed to answer the questions given to you in your lab manual. That concludes Lab 9, Combined Loading. Good luck with the rest of your lab.